Postings to undeposited funds can cause problems in QuickBooks. If we go to our little gear in the top right here and chart of accounts, you'll see if we search under the search box at the top here, undeposited, you'll see we've got an undeposited funds uh, account here and we've got a balance on that particular account. So if you've got a balance on your undeposited funds account, that's showing that you've got funds awaiting to go to the bank. So undeposited funds is the account which holds money that's waiting to be deposited into the bank. So really, it's really quite historic in many ways because we don't tend to receive a lot of checks these days. But the use of undeposited funds historically was to receive checks from clients, put them into undeposited funds. And then we might go to the bank once a week and deposit multiple checks together. So for a lot of businesses, undeposited funds is irrelevant and could be made inactive, really, because they don't tend to receive for, uh, checks from their clients, from their customers. When we've got a balance in undeposited funds here, like we have here, then we would normally post that via the deposit screen to show that the funds have been deposited in. So if we have a look at what's in this particular account, I can go to the right here and run a report and have a look. So we've got two payments received from clients here and they've both gone into undeposited funds. Now, if this is incorrect and these actually were received into the main bank account, we'd need to change this transaction to show it going into the main bank. If these amounts were actually received by check and we're going to the bank with them, then we would go through the plus sign here to bank deposit under the other column. And if you click on bank deposit, you would see here the same transactions waiting to go to the bank. So we can complete this to the current account on the day we go to the bank and tick the entries that we are posting to the bank. So in a way, this is like building your paying in slip to the bank. And then if we save that, those balances move out of undeposited funds into the uh, current account, into the bank account. If you look at your file and under bank deposit, you've got lots of transactions sat here. That's a sign that historically you've got postings to undeposited funds that need to be resolved, need to be sorted out. So we shouldn't have any old transactions uh, that are not correct sat in our undeposited funds account. So undeposited funds can be a problem area for people. Hopefully that explains why it exists. Uh, if you're not receiving checks from people, you might wish to make that account inactive, obviously making sure it's got a zero balance. If you've got historic information in there, it will need to be addressed uh, in terms of sorting out why that has appeared. That's undeposited funds.